Okay, hi. A quick look at something brand new which I stumbled ac across when I went down, got a notification to download the latest beta version of Live. I noticed something else that I hadn't seen mentioned anywhere, which was intriguing. Sequences by Ableton here. And um, you can see it says here, Sequences by Ableton is a collection of creative MIDI sequences made in Max for Live. It mentioned Step Up, an evolution of a classic device first found in the Max for Live Essentials pack many years ago. Step-based arpeggiator, rhythm steps, uh, step sequence uh, designed to work well with drum racks, etc., etc., and SQ uh, inspired by classic hardware sequences, step control over pitch, octave, dot, dot, dot. So um, hit download. Go back into uh, packs and you can see, sure enough, rhythmic steps, SQ, and um, step up. Each one obviously has the usual tutorials. So there's a general welcome here. And uh, as it says, this is a beta version. So please collect and save your sets. Uh, next page. Uh, much more detail here on what ryth rhythmic steps is. I won't read it all out, but. Um, uh, the highlights are it's tailored to function well with Ableton Live's drum racks and um, paired with the new drum sampler device as well as the existing and upcoming expressive drum kit. It strengthens a possible narrative towards a more playful style of beat making. Hmm, flowery stuff. Um, anyway, we'll see in a second, but it's basically got uh, a sequencer with four sequence lines so you can get polyrhythmic and some other nice things. Um, uh, what's the next one? Let's see, uh, Step Up. Now, updated version of um, Max for Live Classics, as we saw. Um, step based arpeggiator with a modernized feature set, fully scale aware. So that means it's going to work with the um, scale settings of your project. That, that recent introduction, Live 12. And uh, SQ. Classic step sequences to generate MIDI patterns, one to 16 steps with different lanes, i.e. pitch, octave, velocity, length, time shift, etc., etc. Um, lots of interesting features listed on the highlights, including randomization, reset, and scramble features. Interesting.